The sale of cigarettes will be permitted. More than 2,000 people opposed it. When it comes to cigarettes, tobacco products, and related, that we should not open up the sale of products. A very public show of force and a reminder of who's controlling South Africa's narrative right now. Not the president, but Compton Minister and Kosazana Tlamini Zuma. How? She used her power and considerable influence to ensure the ban on cigarette sales would continue. Well, just one move and it was done. Why did she do that? Is it because the president is particularly popular right now? Or is it a reminder that the party politics at the Tuli House, the rivalry there, is still very much a play? Well, so Ramaphosa has been publicly emasculated, we, the public, have been duped. How can you discard what the president said just because 2,000 people were against it? And how many more people wanted the sales ban lifted? We've lost 400 million rand because we don't get taxes on cigarettes, yet cigarettes are everywhere at the moment, you know. And we were, able, or we're willing to pay incredibly high prices for the cigarettes. Why impose regulations on people that you cannot really police? What we have to look at here also is, is politics. Well, what, what I'm basically saying is that the link between Mazzotti and the EFF is well known. Who agreed, who uh, in an affidavit admitted to being involved in fraud, money laundering and tax evasion when it comes to cigarettes. No, I'm not saying that Mr. Mazzotti is smuggling cigarettes at the moment. I mean, I have no proof of it, although he is a self-confessed smuggler.